guys, welcome to episode 6 of my Pleasant View Let's Play. And today we're going to be playing the Pleasant family. They live right here at 215 Sim Lane. Um, this is Daniel, Mary Sue, and, and their twin uh, daughters, Angela and Lilith. And their story says, On the surface, Daniel and Mary Sue Pleasant seem to have the perfect life. But is their love a flimsy facade? And can Angela and Lilith make the right choices when it comes to love? So we are going to play this family and find out. I love playing the Pleasant Family. They're a lot of fun to play. They have a lot of drama going on when you first start playing them. So this is the sixth Pleasant View Family uh, that we're playing for the Pleasant View Story. And I'm just going to pause it here for a second so we can take care of a few things before we start playing them. So the first thing I want to do is I'm going to get my trusty bat box. And I'm going to give Daniel and Mary Sue a um, college degree because he is pretty far up in his career. He's an assistant coach in the athletic career. I believe he, this is like level seven or eight. I can't remember exactly, but it's pretty high up. You can see he makes a lot of money. And Mary Sue, she works in the political career. So I feel like both of them would have had a college degree. So I'm going to go ahead and upgrade them. I'm going to give Mary Sue a political science degree because she's in the political career. And there she goes. Now she has all six want slots and she can lock two wants as well. She wants to tickle Daniel and get a promotion. Um, Daniel, we are going to give him... Hmm. Well, none of these really correspond well to... Um, to athletics so I don't know we'll give him a psychology degree it doesn't really matter I don't think okay so now he has all of his want slots oh he wants to woohoo with Mary Sue and make kiss Mary Sue I thought it was make out kiss her and he wants to have three loves at once because he's a romance him okay so I'm going to get rid of that and let's just take a look at their house, um, if you're not familiar with the Pleasant House. Um, it's really nice, except for the upstairs. <laughs> I mean, it's nice, but the layout is just terrible. Um, and I'm pretty sure there's some kind of problem with seasons. Um, it's like really cold up here because the roof doesn't really uh, cover up the, the house. I don't know exactly what's going on, but... Yeah, you can see that it like doesn't have a roof. It has a roof, but it doesn't count as like a ceiling or something for the season's expansion. I don't know exactly, but I know it can get really cold up there. <laughs> so, and the layout is just so bad. But I'm not really ambitious enough to remodel it, so I'm just going to leave it like that and complain about it while I play. And then their backyard, they have a nice um, backyard. Their whole property is fenced in. They have a pool and a nice little area out here. They have a really nice house. They don't really have that much money. They only have 2,250 simoleons, um, which is strange because they do make a lot of money. But I think it's because Mary Sue is a fortune sim, so she likes stuff. So they have, like, a lot of fancy stuff. They have fancy they have the fanciest TV and um, stereo and just a lot of really nice stuff, so she spends most of their money on that. Okay, so now we're going to get started playing, and uh, we're going to see what the scripted events uh, what the scripted events lead us to do here. Okay, so first things first. Who says good help is hard to find? Daniel has his eye on the maid and wants a little romance, but will his decision threaten family unity? So Daniel is having an affair with Kaylin Langrack, the maid, and she does get around. She's also having an affair with Don Lothario, if you remember from my first video. So we're going to see they have a really, really good relationship, and his relationship with Mary Sue is not that great. They're not even in love. Um... They're married and they're friends, but Mary Sue spends most of her time working on her political career now that the uh, twins have grown up, so she's not really around that much. Our family's kind of falling apart. Daniel's having an affair. The girls are like, their relationship is not good. They hate each other, and their relationship with their parents is just not great at all. 
So it's it's not a very happy home. So we're going to see uh, what's going to happen here. So she wants to tickle Daniel. I'm going to go ahead and queue up um, some interactions for them. For the two of them to try to get their relationship a little bit better. Because he wants to kiss her and woohoo with her. Oops. Give her... Oops. Darn it. Give her a kiss. Okay, so now they just became best friends, but they're still not in love. They have two bolts with each other. Oh, now they're in love again. That's all it took, was just a kiss and a tickle. Okay, so the twins are in here fighting. Um, you spend most of your time playing this household trying to keep these two away from each other. Oh, poor Angela. Let's see what their wants are. She wants to reach charisma level one, go to college. We're going to go ahead and save that. Oh, they're getting in a fight again. Slapping each other silly. Oh, gosh. The parents are just standing over here watching TV while the, while the girls fight. Nobody seems to care. She also wants to go to college. So they are both 16 years old, and they're, so they're very close to going to college. Um, Daniel, he is 42 years old, and Mary Sue is 40. And I use a custom um, age mod, or an age hack, actually, um, to determine the ages of my sims and the life stages and everything. So if you're interested in that, you can look at my mod list on my blog. Okay, so Mary Sue's going off to work. The girls are going off to school, and Daniel is going to be home alone. Okay, turn that off. I just didn't like that sound. He wants to gain a skill point, so what does he need for his job? He needs mechanical, charisma, and body. He also needs to go to the bathroom. So we're just going to hang out and wait. He has the day off today. Maybe he'll do a little workout. Um, he's really just waiting for Kaylin to come over and she gets here at 10 a.m. Which is very soon. Okay. Oh, he's gained enthusiasm and fitness. So she should be showing up. Here she is. She's going to come in and clean the house. And we'll see what happens. Bills are due. Okay, the house was completely clean, so she didn't have anything to do, but she wants to hang out. So, of course, Daniel is going to say yes. He wants to hang out. So, we're going to have him come over here and make out with her. Because that's just the kind of guy he is, and he wants to have... He doesn't really have any wants for her. But this is more a part of the scripted storyline that Maxis um, created. Okay, stop working out. And I think this is sort of um, to teach you about like the jealousy and cheating uh, that can go on in The Sims 2. Okay, so they've got that going on. And then he's going to go relax in bed. Daniel, you're a horrible man. But that's just how romance sims are. They can't help themselves. So he's going to ask Kaylin to join him in bed. And they're going to cuddle up and kiss a little bit. And we are waiting for Mary Sue. We are going to... Oh, here it is. The, the uh, chance card. So the controller has a stack of paperwork on his desk, blah, blah, blah. Should she try editing them herself or scan the speeches? I'm just going to say edit because it doesn't matter what you choose here. It's going to be a bad outcome. And she's either going to get demoted or she's going to get fired. And she got demoted. So she's going to be coming home early now. Um, right when Daniel and Kaylin are going to be woohooing in the bedroom. So... This is not going to be good. Oh, I just heard the horn, so Mary Sue is getting home. She's sick, she got demoted, and she's about to walk in on her husband sleeping with the maid. Okay, 
stop kissing. <laughs> oh, Daniel. He was not expecting her to come home early, so he's gonna get busted big time. Oh, and that sound means somebody got caught cheating. So, oh, here she comes. She's gonna run in there. Oh, boy. I don't know how she knew all the way out there that he was in bed with Kaylin, but she knew. That's the Sims for you. They get a sixth sense when somebody's cheating on them. Oh, man, she's mad. She's really mad. I want to take a screenshot. Okay. Oh boy. Yeah, she's really upset. Their relationship is not good. Oh boy. Okay, so first of all, you need to kick her out of your house. Oh boy, she's got like negative 100 relationship with both of those both of them I think she's gonna get a slapper she's gonna I mean I would if that was my husband that's right slap the crap out of her tell her to get out of your house Daniel's just gonna go take a bath he doesn't even care what's going on can you fire her no, you can only fight with her. Look, she's all happy because she woohooed. She doesn't even care that she just destroyed this family. Kaylin, you're a skank. And, of course, her friend Cassandra just showed up at the door. Alright, you can go greet her. Tell her what happened. Oh. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have her gossip, so I think that'll get her to tell Cassandra what happened. Okay, Lilith and Angela are home now. Lilith's doing horrible in school, and Angela's grades are going up. So we'll worry about them. And, okay, she's talking bad about Cassandra, uh, Kaylin. Lilith brought Gavin Newsom home. No! Don't bring this, these Newsom kids home. Oh my god. I can't stand it. Because they can't be friends with him. You can't call them or anything. It's just annoying. They're, they don't live in town. They're, in, they're Ben families. So just go tell him to get out of here. He's not your friend. Oh, and Angela brought Dustin home. Okay, but let's get... Okay, he's just making dinner, just pretending like nothing happened. They've got all kinds of company now. So, something's got to give. She's going to go... They need to talk. Daniel, you need to just stop it and go talk to your wife. Actually, I forgot. I'm going to give them their... Um, their little aspiration benefit. So I'm giving Daniel the romance so that he can have smooth, smooth talk and he can try to smooth things over with Mary Sue because she is really pissed off. And then I might as well just do them all while I'm here. So I'm going to give her the fortune tree and I will give... Okay, Angela and Lilith are popularity sims. So they get um, hospitality um, slower bladder and energy decay, three-way calling, so they can have a phone conversation with three sims, or two sim, two additional sims, and fast friends, so they make friends faster. So I'm going to give those, oh, she only has three for some reason. Okay, so let's get back to Daniel and Mary Sue. They need to work things out. She don't got no. Oh, he's going to go and smooth talk her. Angela's sick with the cold now, too. Okay, Daniel, Dustin, I mean, get out of here. Okay, 
okay, I really wanted them to do this like in private, but they're just gonna do it right here in front of everybody in the living room, okay. Let's see if that worked. Um, that did. It worked. That's all it took. She's okay now. She's forgiven him. Um, the relationship is not great, but it's definitely better. So, I'm gonna have them. He wants to woohoo with her, so maybe that'll make things better. Okay, you two need to get out of parents room that is oh my god you guys can't even take care of yourself for like a minute go use the bathroom don't okay get out <laughs> get out get out get out get out seriously get out of their room oh great <laughs> Okay, you guys just fight, just fight it out then. I'm trying to focus on Daniel and Mary Sue here. They can't even woohoo, so like she must still be really upset. But he, being the romance sim that he is, sim that he is, he's just gonna smooth it all over and just like one day they're fighting in there. I'm, I don't even care anymore. I don't know, Mary Sue. I don't know how you could forgive him so fast, but she has. It's <laughs> Cassandra's out there swimming in the backyard. Oh, they can woohoo. So. I want to check out their relationship now. They're doing a lot better. Definitely doing a lot better. She wants to get a promotion, and she wants to talk to her kids, too, so that's probably a good idea. He wants to continue to make out with tons of people, so... Get up. Oh, get up, Daniel. Go eat one of your sandwich or resume making your sandwiches. Alright, you need to get dressed before you go. Oh my god. They just keep fighting with each other. Throw a sports party, buy an MP3 player. Okay, we're not doing any of that. So, oh well, I guess just keep fighting. They're terrible. Okay, he's serving dinner, so maybe that'll... That'll calm everybody down to get something to eat. Sandra keeps thinking about babies. I wonder if she's pregnant. Daniel's just gonna eat in the bathroom. <laughs> he's like, he's had enough of their crap. Okay, they're getting along okay. Oh my gosh, please turn off this wholesome music, please. Switch to classical. That's a little bit more pleasing. So hopefully when they turn it on now, it'll be classical. Okay, she wants to talk to Angela, talk to Lilith, play with Angela. Okay, so they're going to age up tomorrow. So everybody has just aged up a day. So the girls are now 17. Daniel's 43 and Mary Sue is 41. <laughs> Alright, Daniel. Oh, Daniel. He's going to turn on the radio. Of course he is. He wants to be BFF with Mary Sue. That's something we could pursue. Oh my gosh, he's shaking his butt to the classical music. Oh, it's so funny when they dance to that. <laughs> Cassandra joined in too. <laughs> wow. That's some dancing there. Okay, she's like all in love with him now. She's completely forgotten that he just cheated on her, so. Okay. Play with Lilith, play with Angela, talk to Lilith. 
they're going to be going to college um, very soon, and their relationship with their parents is very bad. So I would like to improve it if I could. We don't have much time. What does she need to get in a promotion? Nothing. She can... Play catch. Oh, Dustin, I forgot you were even here. He's just been hanging out in the background. Aww. I thought they were already in love. Oh, they're in love now. She needs desperately to have some fun. Go watch TV then. Okay, nobody can get in the living room, so just... I don't know, dance. They both, like, have no fun. I don't know what they've been doing all day. Not having fun, obviously. Fighting each other. Okay, did she eat? Yeah, I guess so. Alright, take a bath. Oh, sports. Lilith likes sports. That is really surprising to me, but that's her one true hobby is sports. She's playing hacky sack with Dustin. Alright, so Daniel's going to decide that it's time for everybody to leave. And let's turn this off. And let's go. Everybody should go to bed. It's early, but the girls can stay up a little bit longer. Okay, they're going to watch TV together. Oh no, she looks like she wants to fight. <laughs> She's cracking her knuckles. What's she doing? Oh my gosh, no. Don't slap. Watch TV together. Okay, they're talking. They're talking about sports. Oh, that's good. They're having some positive interactions. Oh, look, only negative 93 relationship. They have negative 100 overall. Talking about meeting new people, kissing. They're getting positive. Look, negative 86. What's hers? Negative 91. Oh. Man, she's got negative with her parents, too. Okay, guys. Time for bed. So, this is Angela's room over here. This, like, really sickeningly sweet pink room. And then Lilith's is this, like, more like goth room over here. Obviously. Okay, Angela, what are you doing? Come to bed. Oh, no, 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 no. Turn that off. Turn that off. She's got, like, the flaming uh, thought bubble because she's so mad at her sister. Well, I wonder what life's going to be like for them in college because um, they're probably going to have to live in the same dorm. Okay, so that was our very eventful um, first day with the Pleasants. Oh, Mary Sue's healthy again. Mary Sue caught Daniel cheating with Kaylin. Daniel somehow managed to smooth things over with Mary Sue, and their relationship is back on track. Um, the kids are not doing so well. Angela and Lilith, they have really bad relationship with each other. Um, Lilith has a terrible relationship with everybody in her family. She has a good relationship with her boyfriend, Dirk, though. Um, so in the next episode, or the next time we play The Pleasants, um, Angela and Lilith are going to be going off to college, and Mary Sue and Daniel are going to work on their relationship some more. Um, in the next episode, I'm actually going to be playing The Burbs and The Oldies, so I hope you'll come back and check that out. Um, if you like my videos, please check out my blog at PleasantSims.com, and there I have like my mod list for all the mods I use, um, my gameplay rules, which includes my aging system, and 
also um, the sim profiles all of the sims I have my bios there and um, the family trees too so I hope you enjoyed it please like and subscribe and leave me a comment if you liked it thank you